Welcome back to E39 Source. Today, typical E39 problem of your alarm going off at random times. You leave the car locked, nobody's around it, nobody touches it, there's no interference whatsoever, and then your alarm goes off. Well, there's many things that could cause this issue, but let's start with an easy one. Up here in the E39, this happens to be an M5, I think they're all the same, probably the E38 7 series, possibly the E46 3 series as well. There's a sensor located right here by your driver's side cabin air filter intake box housing. The filter lives under there, strut tower right here. There's this little bracket that comes off of this plastic bit. There's a wire that goes to it here. There's a sensor that lives right here. It sticks up when you close the hood. It hits the top of the hood, pushes it down. Well, maybe those contacts become brittle. Something goes wrong with them, and it needs to be replaced. It's a cheap part. It's really easy to do. You could just unplug it. Um, plugging, un unplugging the wire from it, you just pull this and pull it out of the sensor. Uh, that will do the same thing, but then you're lacking the piece of hardware and any security that it does, in fact, add. So I just went ahead and replaced it. Here's your part number. See if we can get a focus on that, and I'm going to show you just how it fits in there. There's your part number. Uh, I believe it was about $14 from my local uh, dealer, so it's inexpensive. Let me find that in my pocket real quick, and we'll put it in. Here's what it looks like. This is the plunger that goes down when the hood is shut. You can hear it snap back up into place. Wire and connector just like that. Installing it, making sure that the part where the wire is faces the outside driver's side of the car. Get that out of the way. I think we just kind of lay it in like this, give it a push, and it snaps in. Now it's as easy as connecting our wire, and we should be done. Leave your car locked a while, see if it, uh, if it does it again. If it does, then uh, maybe just unplug it. I'm going to need two hands to push that on there. Uh, but that should be your first step in figuring out why your alarm keeps going off. So a quick, short, easy video, and I hope that helps you out. Thanks for watching, guys. Talk to you in the next video. Bye-bye.